you in the market for a brand new carpet seam iron? Well, if you do, I'm going to give you my uh, professional opinion after 38 years in the business to tell you the best seam iron I have come across in my entire career and tell you why. So uh, you might have guessed it from the thumbnail. It is actually the 893 Taylor Tool Iron. And there are multiple reasons why this iron tops a lot or actually all of the competitors' irons. And I want to run over that just a few, uh, just a, for a few minutes here. And then at the end of this video, I'm going to give this iron away to someone. Uh, typically not this one. It's going to be a brand new one. How's it going, everybody? Thank you for tuning in. And uh, I've already done a video on this. How's it going, Billy Graham? Uh, so uh, I want to point out right here is a little bitty hole. I'm, I've already done a video on this. You guys might have seen it. So right there is a hole where the... Uh, glue will actually get pulled up and out and weld your seam together at the same time as you're making your seam. You can see this little V right here in the back where your carpet will slide right through that right there. What that does, it pulls the nap out of the way, keeps the nap out of the glue and all of that stuff right there. This technology right here is super awesome along with the LED light right there. It makes it really easy to see. This is by all means one of the best irons on the market. Let me see if I can get this off here because... So if you notice right here on the bottom, you can see it's already got glue in it where I've already run this before, but right there is where glue will actually get sucked up in or not, not sucked up in, pushed up in and uh, come out of that little hole right there. So again, that will um, weld your seams together as you're making your seams. Thank you, Bobby Griffin. I appreciate that, buddy. Let me get my big screen going on here so I can see a little bit better. Oops. There we go. So I want to show you guys a couple a couple of seams I made real quick on that video. I mean, on that iron right there. Um, this seam right here was actually seam sealed. You can see this is what it should do if it is seam sealed properly with a thermoplastic seam sealer. It actually stops the seam from breaking open. You can see right there is the tape, and that's exactly what it should do. It stops it from breaking open right there. Let me move those little danglers out of the way there. So if you don't seal your seams, this is what happens. See that right there? Your seam breaks right apart whenever you bend it back like that. What this iron right here does, it will, this is the sealed seam. It will actually bond those two carpets together from the total thickness of the backing of the carpet. So from the very back, uh, from the very backing of the carpet all the way to the top layer of the backing of the carpet. So it is a true weld, uh, just like the carpet was never cut whatsoever. What happens here is, whenever you do that right there, this is only joined at the bottom of the carpet. Look right here. So you can see that right, uh, let's see here. Let me get over here. Maybe you can see it better without that light. So this carpet seam is only joined at the bottom right there, and that's what allows that to break open right there. It is only connected at the bottom of the seam, which is uh, specifically from the seam tape. So what happens is this iron that I'm talking about right now will actually weld it together throughout the entire backing. So it is absolutely awesome. Now let me show you a seam. This is the one that is seam sealed. Let me show you another seam right here. This one is made specifically with this iron right here, okay? No seam sealer, no nothing. There's no need for it because this iron right here literally welds your seam together for you as you're putting it together. So there's absolutely no need to seam seal on that. What that does, that gives you uh, that much more time to focus on other things, gives you that much more time to put your time, your effort into other things if you can skip the process of seam sealing and still come out with awesome results like this. Look at that. See that? That is no seam sealer whatsoever. This has been made specifically with this iron, okay? It works the exact same way as if you thermoplastic sealed it, okay? So this is a huge benefit to the industry. It's a huge benefit to the seaming methods in, in all aspects of it. It saves you the step of not putting the sealer on there and yet you still get the absolutely perfect weld right there you never ever have to worry about sealing it and you never ever have to worry about it uh coming apart 
breaking open, anything like that, if you flop it out to make your seam or anything like that. If you flop it out, you can uh, make your seam. Then, you don't, when, then when you fold it back over into the cubby or ha halfway through the room or anything like that, you don't have to worry about your seam breaking apart or anything. It's going to be solid. It's going to be welded like crazy, okay? This iron right here is absolutely awesome. This is definitely the best iron. Look at that right there. The best iron I've ever come in contact with ever. How's it going, Jared? Thanks for tuning in. Just talking about this iron again right here. I got one more of these to give away. And um, I just can't get enough. I can't, I can't say enough about it. So I wanted to talk about it some more while I gave another one away. And you might say, well, what about that little fin right there in the back? So what happens right here? This thing don't nearly don't uh, don't necessarily get in the way of anything or uh, cause problems or anything like that. Looky here, see that? So it's actually spring loaded right there. It go, moves up and down, so it never is going to bind anything up, cause any kind of problems. It is actually a awesome, awesome feature on this. Even on the 890 that uh, Taylor Tools makes, it, it pulls your nap together perfectly. I, as I've stated in multiple other videos of seaming with this iron and the 890, it almost puts the seam together for you. Not even talking about the Teflon on top, which prevents the backing of your carpet from getting too hot and becoming overheated, delamination problems or curling up problems. Everybody knows that installs carpet. If you get your seam too hot while you're running your iron, you run your iron too slow or you got it turned up too high or anything like that, right on your seam when you got your carpet like this, right on your seam, it's going to go like that right there. And it don't matter if you push it in tight, pull it in tight or anything, it's still going to go together like that. So if it gets too hot right in there, see where my thumbs are right there? So if you're carpet gets too hot right there it's going to it's just going to curl as you put it together like that and you can push it all the way in and it's still going to just it'll come together but it'll still be humped up like that there's no way around it so this teflon right here will prevent that from getting too hot you can have this iron wide open running it burning your seam and everything and literally grab a hold of that teflon and it don't burn you that's how that's how much of a heat preventative that is right there i, I demonstrated that in the last video i did uh, of this 893L and the L stands for that light right there. Thank you, Bobby Griffin. I appreciate that once again. So again, right here on the back of that is LED lights. So it shines plenty bright right here where you need it, where you're putting your seam together. This, this is an absolute awesome iron. Okay. Uh, it's got multiple, uh, most of the Oricon irons, which I've used uh, all of my life up until just a few years ago has only got settings one through four this one actually goes one uh, it's actually stops right there from zero to five so it's got more settings where you can get it more accurate right there I run this iron on about three or four three and a half or four and that is comparison to the two and a two and a half or three when you're speaking of the Oricon irons so uh, I don't know much else to say about this thing outside of it's just absolutely an awesome iron all the way around. It's, it's, uh, I wish I had a tape measure in here. I would like to measure this right here, measure the neck right here. And, uh, oh yeah, the 20, 23 and a half foot cord on it. Look at that wad of cord. <laughs> you don't see irons like that right there. This cord, uh, 23, six is what I measured it at whenever I measured it. You don't see a seam iron with a cord on it like that. This is awesome. You don't need no extension cord at all whatsoever. It don't drain your power from the iron or anything. Look at that. That's a phenomenal wad of cord for a seam iron. It's a super fat. Look at the cord too. It's a really fat, heavy duty cord. So there's not going to be, like I said, any issues with it pulling, pulling power from it or anything like that. You're never going to need an extension cord. You could be in a room that's 50... Uh, almost 50 foot long and plug up in the center of the room and not never have to unplug your cord Unplug your iron to switch it or run a cord on it. Think about that almost a 50 foot room You have 48 foot room never unplug your iron or never use a cord. That's pretty awesome Okay uh, There was actually a gentleman that um, Hold on for a second I just want to point this out again. This is phenomenal right here. I love this. 
I was super thrilled whenever here, it, it ain't been that long ago, just a couple years when I started sealing my seams. I went my whole career without sealing them. And I, I done this with the thermoplastic seam sealer and I was like, bam, that's awesome. Okay. Just a couple years ago, you guys can see the video, two ways of seam sealing carpet is when I first discovered the, uh, glue gun seam sealing method. And, uh, I was amazed that it would hold like that right there. And lo and behold, there's an iron that does it for you. Check that out. Look right there's the tape. Look at that. It never loses its profile. It never breaks open in the center of the seam or anything. That is phenomenal. <laughs> That's awesome. All right. So what we're going to do on this video, like I was started to say something a while ago. Uh, there was a gentleman actually called in. So whoever gets this can uh, give a big thumbs up or something to uh, the gentleman. It's nothing short of magical. <laughs> Uh, so what I want to do is I want to give this to somebody who has not won anything yet. Okay. So if you've already won something, uh, don't, uh, you can play along or whatever. I don't care. But anyway, I want to make sure someone gives this. I want to make sure someone gets this who has not won anything. Okay. Uh, there's been a lot of people winning multiple things. There's certain people that's got just boxes full of stuff that they're going to be getting. So, uh, we're going to give this to someone that has not got anything. <sighs> About wore myself out right there. Thank you, Billy Graham. Uh, um, let's see here. Uh, I'll tell you what. I'm going to go right there. I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to pick someone, okay? And, uh. You guys will just have to not get mad or get mad or whatever you want to do, but I'm just going to handpick someone. So I'm going to go right there. Uh, Mr. Carpet Man, you haven't won anything. You've been a follower of mine for a long, long time since almost the beginning that I know of, if not the beginning. So Mr. Carpet Man, Mr. Phil, I'm going to give this to you, okay? Appreciate you for being a long time subscriber. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and write that down for you. You uh, message me your information and stuff like that. And I am going to get this seam iron sent out to you. As a matter of fact, you'll probably get this before anybody else gets their stuff. Because I started to say something a while ago. There's a gentleman that actually uh, uh, messaged me about, um, he said, I want, to, I want to contribute this to the giveaway. So this is not even specifically from any company or anything like that. There's a gentleman sitting here. I hope it's okay that I say this. Daniel Sherman uh, said, I want to give this away. And uh, um, so he said, give me their information and I will send it. I'll, I'll order it and have it sent to them specifically. So you'll probably get yours before anybody else because this is coming from a different person. So um, thank you, Danny Sherman, for doing this for the giveaway. I'm sure uh, Carpet Man is going to love it. It's a very, very awesome seam iron. <clears throat> Make sure that you message me your information on Facebook or you can email me at um, floorsbysouthernboys at gmail.com, okay? Okay, I got you written down there. Uh, all righty. You the man, Daniel. That was super awesome of him to do that. So I agree with that, Sean. He is the man. I don't believe this. Wow, thanks. Yeah, thank uh, Danny Sherman because it was totally him, okay? Right on, Daniel. Christmas spirit is contagious. Merry Christmas, he said. Thank you, Danny. I appreciate that, buddy. That was super awesome of you to do that. Um, wow, love good people. You rock, Danny. Yep. <laughs> good job. Nice. Okay. All right. Uh, with that being said... Um, Actually, still got a few more of these. I forgot about these. Let's go ahead and play the number game. Get one of these. Get rid of one of these. Thanks, Daniel Sherman. Big time Merry Christmas. Yep. I can't wait till you get that iron fill. You're gonna you're gonna love it, dude. <laughs> oh mercy. I've never seen such an awesome iron in my life. I'm not just saying that either. That is the top dog of all seam irons there is right there. 
Anyway, <laughs> let's see here. Okay, let's go uh, between, uh, let's see here. Hold up, check it out. We're going to do this right here. This is one of the Roberts row finders right here. Hold up, hold up. Y'all don't go yet. Uh, GT cushion back cutter. Uh, it's a row cutter is what it is. So really cool. And um, I've already got a number wrote down. So uh, hold on. We're not going to go right yet. We're going to start with flooring professional. Anything, hold up, Joe S. Anything under Joe S is number nine. We're going to go right now. And whoever gets it, okay, someone got it already right there. The bill, 9999, got it. It was number eight. Look right here. Thank you, Bobby. I appreciate that, buddy. So number eight was it, and it was like one of the first numbers picked. So let's turn around here and take a look. Uh, let's see. I said we was going to start right here under him and underneath the Joe S's number nine, and that was the second number there was right there. You guys see that? Oops. Right there. That's what the, was the second number. Right. Oops, sorry. <laughs> right there's where we started. His was number two. So if you will send me your information, I'll get this. This will be sent out to you. Uh, bill, the bill, 9999, okay? Uh, message me on Facebook, Floors by Southern Boys, or you can email me, floorsbysouthernboys at gmail.com, okay? And I will mark you down for that. And thank you guys for tuning in. I picked eight. Uh, he was he was first. Okay, I go by what I see on my screen. It might be first on your screen, but I go first what is on my screen. Uh, we are giving some stuff away, Corey. We just gave away one of these row finders, and we also just gave away one of these. Super awesome irons made by Taylor Tools. The 893 seam weld iron. Um, uh, I'm going to do another review on a product that I have not reviewed yet. So I'm going to cut this off and start over. And I will see you guys in a few minutes. Until next time, FBSB's out.